Hi, my name is Julia and this is Space Daily News Channel. The spacecraft Juice could not deploy the antenna of one of its instruments, representatives from the European Space Agency said on Friday, April 28. The instrument is designed for subsurface studies of Jupiter's moon using ice penetrating radar to detect signs of habitable conditions. The $1.1 billion Juice spacecraft launched on April 14, 2023, and is scheduled to arrive at the Jupiter system in July 2031. It is expected to spend several years exploring Jupiter's icy moons. So far, 10 of the 11 spacecraft instruments are working fine. But the radar antenna for icy moons exploration is jammed in its mountain bracket. Engineers suspect a tiny stuck pin is holding it back. In the near future, mission specialists will make several attempts to retrieve the important instrument from its current position. The plan is to conduct a series of rotations of the vehicle that will rotate juice so that the radar antenna and mount are not in the shadows in order to warm them up. If the 16-meter antenna will be deployed, this will allow the JUICE spacecraft radar to penetrate up to 9 km below the surface of Jupiter's moons, such as Ganymede or Europa. This kind of research is very important for astronomers, because for example on Europa, according to scientists, there is a subsurface salty ocean hidden from us under several kilometers of ice. In 2016, Hubble obtained unique photographs of geysers emerging and erupting on Europa's surface. And if there is water in a liquid state on Europa, it is possible that there could be living creatures in it. Therefore, studying the subglacial oceans is one of the main goals of the JUICE mission. This is not the first time a mission of Jupiter has encountered a problem when deploying antennas. For example, NASA's Galileo spacecraft never managed to deploy a high-gain antenna correctly. Galileo was still able to send important data back to Earth, but at a slower rate than planned. Space Daily News. Like, share and subscribe.